Hi, I am Roxana from VP State and in this video I will show how to set the location of a listing on the map. In the listing page you will have a map where a pin with the listing location will be displayed. In this video you will learn how to set the pin location on the map. First I will start with the settings that you need to make in Team Options. So I will open Team Options. First I will go to map. Here you will be able to decide on the map system that you want to use. You can use OpenStreet or Google Maps. If Google Maps will be selected then a Google Maps API key will need to be created and added in the team. For this video I will leave OpenStreet selected. Next in pin management you will be able to select the type of pins that you want to display on the map. You have the option to use price pins which is this one or you can use image pins that you will need to manually upload here and on the map the image that you uploaded will show next you will need to go to payments and submit and in listing submit page you will need to select the address details that will show in submission form it is mandatory to select property latitude and property longitude for the pin location on the map to be saved next i will go on front end and i will add a new listing to show how to save the pin on the map. I have opened here the submission form. Here the city and the area will need to be filled in. Currently I have enabled autocomplete or address. The pin settings can be found in location section. Here you will need to add the location details like address. I will add random details. With OpenStreet you will have autocomplete for address. This option will not be available for Google Maps. So I will select here a location and you can see that on the map the pin was placed in the right position and you also can see that the values for latitude and longitude coordinates have been generated as well. I will save the changes made. If I go to the listing page and check the map section I will have the map with the pin placed in the correct position. I will go back to the submission form. I will go back to location. The second way to place the pin on the map is manually. This means that manually you can double click on the map in the position that you want and the new coordinates will be saved as well. For example, I will place the pin here. The coordinates have been updated as well. I will save the change and on refresh on the map, I will see the new position. Going back to the submission form, you will have a third way to save the listing location. I will go back to location and here you will be able to manually add the coordinates for the pin to be saved on the map. You can take the coordinates from Google Maps. You need to click on the map and here you will have the coordinates of that location. You will need to copy them and pass them manually in the team. Save changes and now the pin was placed in the new location. Also in the listing page on refresh you will see the new listing location. The VP Rentals team has the option to hide the location of the listing on the map for users that do not have a booking confirmed. I will show how to work with this option as well. First I will show how to enable it. You will need to go to team options, design, listing page settings, here you will have this option hide map location and address for unbooked properties you need to set this option to yes and save the change if i go now to the listing page on refresh the pin will not show anymore and you will see this circle with the nearby location of the listing also in address details you will have this message. The exact details will show after the user will have a confirmed booking for this listing. This wraps our video. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get instant notifications on new videos.